here at Slingan Island better known as one of the turtle islands here in Sandakan been staying the night here it's almost 6 30 a.m. we're gonna have breakfast and at 7 the boat will take us back onto land um, there is no network here well they say I'm on DG so if you're on people say if, if you're on Cellcom you you get to send SMSs uh, but you still can't really surf um, I mean send uh, messages via WhatsApp um, so yeah I've been without internet for uh, I can't remember not more than 24 hours definitely but definitely over 12 hours but yeah other than that oh my, it's been a bit stressful but it's kind of refreshing but with that's beside the point the reason you you want to be you want to come here is to see the turtle lay their eggs and then see the process of how you know um the the, the they're being taken care of um so that you know the 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 eggs will survive so as you can see, I think from my uh, uh, the B rolls be, uh, before this uh, or after this, you see the hatchery, how the uh, rangers would like take the eggs and um, and then put it here, and then after sixty days, um, it'll hatch up. That just the the babies will just come up, and then slowly they'll be released. So there's uh, the the chances of them surviving. Um, is is better in the hatchery um, like 80% better than just being left on the beach where there are monitor lizards actually hunting for them so yeah I mean this is a, a, a great job and it, they've been doing this, this since the 70s so this island has not much as you probably see from the room it's pretty basic you you know your toiletries don't forget them they don't provide you there's there's a shop here but that doesn't sell much except for food um, but there are mosquito repellents and things like that but yeah um, it's I was hoping for a good uh, sunrise but unfortunately it was cloudy but the thing that matters the most is that we actually, the turtle actually came up around eight ish so there are instances that they only come up at two in the morning so you know so good luck about that so they're very picky also so when there's there's this certain conditions on the, you know if it's too noisy if there's too bright lights and things like that they sometimes they they opt for another island for but last night i think there's quite a lot already uh, on the other side there's about six or seven uh, we, we 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 saw the trails so yeah um last night also they released quite a lot of turtles uh, okay one more thing 
when when you go and watch the the turtle lay their eggs and all that um you are not allowed to video you are only allowed to take photos and also per device so per camera you have to pay 10 rm so yeah take note of that there's a 10 dollar entry for for the park and yeah so they're very strict about that so no filming so no video so you're probably gonna see a slideshow of the photos that i took uh but yeah it, it's really it's really an amazing experience i mean you you've always seen it on tv i've always seen it on tv so watching it you know with your own eyes is something really definitely memorable also you can adopt a nest so for 100 rm they will label one of those uh hatchery this nest under your name and then you get also a t-shirt and also a certificate i'll show a bit later um but yeah that that's that's it actually um it's it's definitely you know this island is definitely a, a, i guess a place to detox from your social media <laughs> oh, but i don't want to do it again <laughs> but yeah other than that, yep. Um, I'll I'll put down some links below on how you can uh, book your place here. Okay, now take me back to Sandakan. I really need my internet. <laughs> Oh, uh -huh.